to my life. I can take a wild guess. <laughs> you know what's crazy? What is this? Sushi means sex. What is going on on this show? It's the lighter side of the dark side. <laughs> my life. I can take a wild guess. <laughs> you know what's crazy? What is this? Sushi means sex. What is going on on this show? It's the lighter side of the dark side. <laughs> Josie's putting her phone on vibrate. Welcome, everybody. It's uh, the lighter and I'm side. I'm sticking it down my pants. I'll bet you are. It's the lighter side of the dark side, your Thursday night freak show. Welcome to the Dark Mark Show. That's my co host, straight from the dentist again. I know. Uh, Josie Cat. Josie, you uh, know what to do. Nice say, and loopy. You want to say hello to the dark minions out there? Hello, dark minions. We've got a very special show tonight. Uh, this is. Uh, this is the show I was going to have last month, but I'm glad I... Uh, Josie, when you were gone, 
I had so many great shows when you were gone, and you I were, know. <laughs> I hate you for that. And one one of the one of the great shows <laughs> I had was with the wonderful lady sitting next right next to you, Sin Fisted. I know. Sin and, and I know each other. Ah, uh, you know each other very well. I know uh, you guys had the foot off last year on my show as well. And everybody knows Sin Fisted. Everybody loves Sin Fisted. Everybody wants That's to know what Sin Fisted is. The foot off. The foot off. Uh, Melrose, uh, we had a show with a couple of comedian friends of mine, and one of the guys has a big foot fetish. Do you have a foot? Oh, Melrose Larry Green is here. Uh, you know him from the Howard Stern Show. You know him from the Street Corner. You know him from all sorts of things. He was in a Whoopi Goldberg movie. I didn't know that. He ran for mayor. There's a lot of stuff about this guy. Twice. I ran for mayor twice. Well, we'll talk about yeah. that. But uh, do you like feet? No, not really. No. Really? You're not a foot guy? Okay. <laughs> no, I, I never understood that. Well, I, I, ha I have a friend that's a really... Keep those feet away from him. No, no, I'm sure, I'm sure he'll... Uh, stinky right now, too. <laughs> I'm an ass guy. I'm an ass guy. You're an ass guy. Okay. Uh, okay. But there's a lot of, there's a lot of guys... I mean, that's... There's a lot of guys that are into feet, and uh, we had one of my friends who was into feet that was on the show, and uh, since uh, Sin Fisted had, uh, won a, uh, was a, a prize winner in a foot fetish thing, we, yeah. it was she the showed him the feet. most unique, exotic, and captivating foot model. Right. And so we had her and Josie have a foot off and shove their feet in his face. Wow. His eyes bu bugged out of his head. But before we start with that, I want to say, Melrose Larry Green is here. It's really, it's great to be here. I want to tell you something before you even get started. My management, I have a manager and an agent and all that. Yeah, so do I. They, um, they were not crazy that I'm Instagram. doing this. I make my decisions in life, though. I appreciate I, that, Melrose. I, I really like you. You're a great comedian. And to be with my new friend Josie Cat and Sin Fisted. This is like, I feel like Derek Jeter in Yankee Stadium right Well, now. well you should. To be sitting with these two women, I can, yes. I, I was going to have yes. you sit in between them, but... I was going to say a Mel Witch. Well, so, I, you I, you, you, you want to switch places with Mel and have a Mel Witch? I, I wrote her a note with my phone number. Let's do it. There, there's a better chance of me landing on the moon than her ever Hey, Melrose, do you mind uh, switching with Sin so it's, they can have a Mel Witch? Whatever you want. Yeah, Sin, why don't you switch with, with Melrose? I am, I am okay. the next hour, you guys, I will do whatever you guys want. Okay, well, they... Oh, <laughs> really? Hey, yes. oh, all right. Yes. I don't think... Whatever. Did you watch any of the past shows? Yeah, have you seen my show? No, she's not all of them. He saw the one... He saw the one with... People, he saw the one with Sin Fisted and, uh, yes. No, no, we, we no, haven't no, killed anybody yet. Not yet. Well, maybe I'll be the last, last week, Last week, we had a woman strip naked and a guy painted her like a clown. Ooh, I'm much taller than this one. Really? Yes, yes like we did. Yeah, really, you got to you got to check out the show. No, well, what I want is to give. This is to be here at Skid Row Studios. is an honor. I love downtown LA, and I haven't done a program like this in a long time. I get right. offered, but I want to give good radio and TV, basically. Right. And a shout out to the kids that are in the booth over there. Like, right. You know, so let's, those, let's, those crazy kids. Those oh, Jenny, crazy Jenny, kids. Jenny, 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 they're they're <laughs> substituting for Jeremy. Who's usually there. Jenny's here. We love when Jenny comes, looking beautiful as always, and uh, and uh, her boyfriend's right there, so I'm not I'm not hitting on her. Uh, Melrose, I am. Melrose, we're gonna have uh, oh yeah, <laughs> Melrose, uh, yes. and we're gonna have some great radio. But uh, I, if, if, you, if you shut up for two minutes, I got something to say. Yes. No, I'm kidding. He, he, I'm trying to I'm trying to be stern, like shut up, Melrose. You know that kind of thing. So, uh, we're being sponsored by Audible.com. Audible.com. Is great. Now, you listen to audiobooks, uh, Melrose. I'm sure you do, right? He brought all kinds of paperwork with him. Right. I know you read a lot. He audiobooks are lot. great. If you go to audibletrial.com forward slash darkmarkshow or just go to darkmarkshow.com, you can get a free audiobook and a free 30 day trial at audible.com. Josie, I picked out a book for you. It's no, I know. I only look at pictures. So well, no, no. I like pop-ups. Well, wait a second. Wait, <laughs> this may pop. This, Scratch and sniff. This, this may pop you up because I know how you are such a fan of Bram Stoker's Dracula. Absolutely. How would you like to hear an audiobook of Bram Stoker's Dracula as performed by Tim Curry? No way. And Alan Cumming and an all-star cast. That sounds like fun. Go to audible.com. Go to Bark Mark Show. Do the free trial. You get a free audiobook, free MP3. Put it on your iPod. Burn it on a CD. It's yours for free. Here's the Dark Mark Show. Melrose Larry Green. Yes. Are you Jackie Mason's accountant or not? No, I'm a good friend. I work with him, but I'm not his accountant. Were you ever his accountant? No, I was the accountant for Andrew Dice Clay and okay. a lot of other comedians, but never Jackie's. Jackie, oh, I work I work. Because that's a rumor. We're going to spell a lot of rumors about Melrose Larry Green. Oh, yeah. You can ask me anything. But if you, go to, if you go to audible.com, yes. you can get Jackie Mason Live in London because they have not only audiobooks, they have a lot of comedy yeah. albums, such as Jackie Mason Live in London. They got Louis C.K., Carlin, Classic Gold. Uh, Kevin Hart, whatever you want. I love Go Kevin to Hart. Uh, Kevin Hart, it's great. Yeah. Audible.com. Sin? 
you, you don't think there's anything on Audible.com for you, is do you think? Uh, How about Seven Deadly Sins, uh, written and and spoken by Corey Taylor from Slipknot? Ooh, that's on that Audible.com. Audible.com oh. has something for everybody. If you're into Dracula, if you're into Jackie Mason, if you're into Slipknot, go to Audible.com. Have a free book, a free trial on us. You can cancel any time in the 30 days, but I'll bet you don't. I'll bet you want to get a – once you start looking through the books, you'll want a book a month. It's really great. So that's the Audible.com spot. It's the first time I've actually been able to do it right. <laughs> this Bravo. Because the first time uh, Josie was on Novocaine a couple weeks ago, it didn't quite go over. But now it's <laughs> Were you time. drooling? Yeah, I'm always drooling anyway. Well, yeah, because because I'm right in front of you. You're looking at me. I would drool, too. Anyway, I'm going to turn this camera around because um, it's time for the Josie Cat. Melrose, Josie Cat is the queen of Hollywood. Everything in Hollywood goes through her. This is the Josie Cat Hollywood Report. <laughs> Josie, girl, you look so hot. <laughs> Yeah. Oh, okay. Sex Junkie vote for sound. Give it to me, baby. I need some more. Sex Junkie, Sex Junkie, Sex Junkie whore. First time sex Junkie, Sex Junkie. It's, it's really complicated. Listen, Melrose. No, oh, okay. That was Josie Kadner band Pissant uh, singing Sex Junkie whore. Beautiful. What do you think about that? I love it. Great. You're phenomenal. Push me down, down the floor. Give it to me, baby. I need some more. The, oh. My favorite lyrics are... Uh, I need a baby all through the night. Come on, baby, don't put up a fight. Melrose, would you put up a fight with this woman? I, I would do anything. <laughs> straight at my chest. <laughs> <That's> <laughs> Josie, what happened in Hollywood it's this all. week? Hollywood, well, the last few weeks, had a great time thanks to um, my buddies. Um, House of Broken Promises. Right. Rule. Thank you, Arthur and um, the chief editor of High Times, Bobby. Right. right. For um, a little, the High Times convention. You, 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 got, some, you got some. You uh, got some. You got some souvenirs. Um, no, I didn't get no High souvenirs. High Times. But wink, I, wink, souvenirs. I, <laughs> <laughs> but I. But I went to uh, their their big event. And it was pretty cool. Right. Um. And other than that, um, well, you know, I was at a, an event the in show, Hollywood this week. This week, Carrera played, and it was super fun. Carrera put is. together this <laughs> crazy show. Um, I I was carried out uh, by a mad doctor, flung over his back in a straight jacket. My girlfriend, who who Missy is the special effects artist. She's only 18 years old mm. and already doing True Blood and all these great shows. And how come you didn't introduce um, me to her? You've met Missy. You Have met I? her on set. Did I? Yeah, for the video. Oh, yeah. Okay. Missy Munster. Um, she carved help. Yes. On my chest. So when I took off the straight jacket. Do I need to zoom in on that? or? Hot, hot, hot dancers. This is this is the, this is the show Almost I, did, I, I uh, invited you, Melrose. I was there for a few minutes. I got there. And oh, okay. I, yeah, and you didn't, didn't. You probably got there early and uh, we yeah, were on. I, I don't stay long. I got there because you invited me. Right. The right. one in Bordner's, right? Right, Bordner's. Yeah. yeah I was did there. you see sexy dancers? And no, I was there for machine. exactly two minutes. Wow, wow, that's pretty fast. I didn't see Sin Fisted, so I took right. off. Well, I, well, see, <laughs> the only reason I'm here is Sin Fisted. I understand. Uh, Carrera is, no seen. offense to you guys. I, I am seen. Carrera is Josie's other band. She has P Piss Hand and Carrera. She's like the guy, the Maynard James Keenan, but she's got tits. That was the password to get in, Carrera, yes. right? Carrera. Yeah. Yeah. I read your uh, emails to me. I I, I know. So anyway, uh, Josie, I, I would go, keep going with the Hollywood Report, but Mel Rose is taking over the show. He's not going to let me talk. <laughs> Mel Rose, I agree. We'll, we'll let him talk. I'm not I really mean, taking he, it over. Right. I'm here you, every you, week. Uh, you will be, I'm sure. Well, we, we, we're going to try to stop that. I Sin will do whatever Sin Fisted wants. Well, well I, I, first of all, I wanted to. What do I, uh, what I want? But we, well, we've got some we've got some plans for you. Sin do we get to spank him? Yes, we do. Are you going to be part of the spank train? I don't get to spank him. You guys get to spank him. First, first, first. And you get to spank us. Everything's up to sin fist. Okay, okay. What do you think about spankings? I, you, you want to know the truth? I love it. Right? Do you like uh, it, getting, getting spankings or, or no, giving spankings? No, Keep your I like feet away from I like, him. I like, but... I like to spank girls. Oh, okay. And I don't mind being spanked. Well, wait a second. Oh, okay. If sin fisted wanted to spank you. No problem. No problem. Okay. <laughs>
But you and I were just talking about this, yeah, about we, how no much problem. I hate I hate getting spanked. She hates getting... You, 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 I, I don't like getting spanked jo, 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 I'd rather uh, get punched in the ass than spanked. I like thuddy. <laughs> I don't like stinging. I, I actually so I if someone slaps me in the ass, I want to turn around and punch him in the face. But if they punch me in the ass, I'm like, ooh. Josie, I punched her in the good. ass on the way up. In the elevator. Yeah, I still feel it too. That's a good. <laughs> I gave her a nice Burn. uppercut. It was yeah. great. It was like it was very. <laughs> the elevator yes. was really good. <laughs> so, uh, Melrose Larry Green is here. Melrose Larry Green, if, if you don't know, and uh, he is from. He, he, I shouldn't say you're from the Howard Stern show, but you. You can say that. Yes, uh, but you, you you call you have called into the Howard Stern show for years, thousands of times. Yes, and by the way, uh, Nixon is downstairs. If somebody can get him, to, yes. Oh, yeah, get him quick because he's, he's yes. hot. He is hot. You are too, but yes. we need another. Melrose Larry Green. Well, here's before I, before I go on because yes. I want to make sure I'm not uh, uh, ruining any protocol because right. I saw on, on YouTube where you were on the uh, Man Cow Show and I caused a rip between you and Howard Stern. You know, I friends with Dice Clay, really good friends with Andrew Dice Clay before right. I ever knew Howard. And we were at a store called Golden Apple, it's a comic book store that you know right. on, Mel on Melrose. On Melrose, yeah. Oh yeah, I know Golden. And um, I'm sure you do know. And we were there, and Mancow was there, and he said to me, Melrose, you want to come on my show? I, I of course I'd go on. Right. And it didn't cause a rift. I think I can't believe that Howard was is so sensitive that he right. really felt that Melrose is is. Uh, you know, that important. I, I wouldn't think that a guy of Howard Stern worth $800 million would care what Melrose Larry Green does. Right. But he, we're over that. I mean... Okay, so going on the dark march is not going to prevent you from being on the Howard Stern. No, no, I love Howard. Because, Tracy, let me explain who Man Cow is, because you you did, had no idea, and I don't think anybody no, does. I actually yeah. do know. I grew up in the Bay Area, right. so I grew up listening to Man Cow he, He's like the Chicago Howard version yeah. of Howard Stern. Yeah. Howard doesn't like Man Cow. Howard doesn't like Jay Leno. Right. Man and it's, Cow. You know, I, I never got everybody into... Everybody loved Jay Leno. Except, except I think... I yeah. think, no, I think uh, uh, no, no comedians like Jay Leno. All the comedians think Jay Leno sucks. You're kidding. They respect Jay Leno for what he did in the right. '80s. In the '80s, he was brilliant. Uh, so as soon as he took over the Tonight Show, he's a sellout, and he doesn't put oh, he didn't geez. put comics in the Tonight Show. That was the big complaint. Oh, yeah, interesting. Because because right, uh, actually somebody right. uh, somebody uh, actually Jimmy Walker made a great point that Chelsea Handler's broken out more comics than Jay Leno ever did. Yeah. Huh. And uh, I love Chelsea. I, I, I love her. her. She's there awesome. he is. The, Nick Sin is right here. Yeah. Hey, Nick. Hey Nick. Nick, yeah, you want to sit that? You want to move your purse so that? And by the way, come on over. You can just. And by sit the way, right you're, on my lap. your purse and Nick's in are about the same size. You want to sit I, on Josie's lap? I'm gonna put him in my purse and I like take him, him all. Hey size. Nick, do you mind sitting on Josie's lap? Yeah, okay. Okay, so Nick's in is gonna sit on Josie's oh, lap looks for like the show. He brought. The he, oh, he brought some, uh, what's that, Sailor That's Jerry? What do you got? That looks like fireball. A fireball. fireball. You know the way to Sin's heart. I gotta make sure. I gotta taste it. Make sure there's no poison in it. Melrose, this is <laughs> this is Nick Sin. How are you doing, Nick? Melrose, Larry Green, nice to meet you. Yeah, I got fine. a big butt. Yeah. Uh, what would you think? No, that's my ass. Yeah, no, I, yeah. I, I uh, have the ghetto booty. Tr trust me. Wait, trust let me, me see. Go ahead, go ahead, Joseph. I have a tiny little bun. Trust, trust me, trust me, uh, Nick. Uh, her ass is probably bigger than your whole body uh, in, 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 in some respects. Yeah. No it's, joke. It, it's nice. It's good. It's it's fluffy. We were talking Melrose, it's Larry fluffy. Green. <laughs> Melrose, Larry, you told me, though, Josie, the first time you saw Melrose Larry Green, you used to drive to work through Melrose. Yes. And would see him I on did. the street holding I would signs. See him on the corner of uh, Melrose and Highland. Pine or Highland. No, Highland. Highland. I was Highland. Highland. Yeah. And now I'm just really curious if you were, you were doing accounting and doing the show. Why in the hell are you standing out on the street corner? Well, well let me, let me just say this. Because he's a prostitute. This. No. Yeah. <laughs> is that we finally figured out the secret of Melrose Larry Green if the whole I, time? I, I will tell you very he simply. He was on the wrong boulevard. The, the, <laughs> the reason why the reality shows like America's Got uh, Talent and, and The Voice and Ameri American Idol, the reason why people look at these programs is that no matter what, people want to be famous. Right. And I come from a family of lots of scientists and doctors. I'm probably the only one in my family that's not a scientist. Or You're the only one your family standing in a strip car with a sign, that's Howard right. Stern changed that's my right. life. Howard, he did. He did. He's a great guy. And I came up with this idea because, you know, it's, it's something different. And I've always felt that you got to do what you got to do. I, for example, think that what you do is brilliant, the goth comedian. I think the entire uh, alternative lifestyle in this world is great. I think that, you know, we're not here forever in this world. Right. You know, you got to make the best of it. 
and I'm blessed. I mean, I've got a great fucking life. But I, I uh, here's here's the, the you other. can ask me anything. How long at all. would you stand out there? That, that's sometimes a good question. Hours, sometimes in the in the heyday, five six hours a day. And and you got really no you got Do you really noticed. That's insanity. Well, I was gonna ask him. I, I can't even. I can't even. I can't even wait two seconds for the light to turn to walk across the block. <laughs> but not really, well, uh, Josie. Right? Let, me, let, me, let me tell you the, the bottom line of it. I, I jaywalk. It, it Sorry got me known all over the world, really not like a, not only the country. Guy. Yes. And nice, like, Josie. <laughs> Josie just had a dental procedure. She's on Nova again. You'll have to forgive her. And plus, she, You're so she hit Nick Sin in the head with her breast and apologized. I don't think you need to apologize for that. I think he's Did okay with it. Right, so, right, Nick? Yeah, I'm fine. I'm just going to keep drinking. Okay. You know what you're saying. Nothing is crazy if you like it. Here's an example. Let's okay. talk about spanking, okay? Or being yeah, why not? A, or being an, an S and M scene at all because I love S and M. That's all we talk about. Okay. Yes. So you Yo, can someone, someone, is looking at your chops. someone that doesn't understand the scene right. of all, doesn't understand how I see my horns coming through my ears. How Hi. anybody <laughs> that can do the things they do. I mean, I look, I went to Catholic Mass. I'm Jewish. I went to Catholic Mass a couple of times over on Rossmore. Right. And I saw the ritual of what went on and I thought not only is it ridiculous, but the entire story of Jesus is totally ridiculous. And I work in front of the Scientology building on Hollywood Boulevard now, right. and they have their own thing, and people have their own values in this world. Right. And who am I and who are you and who are anybody here to say that somebody else uh, is, is crazy or well, wrong? Which is interesting because you just did. You just said Catholics are crazy and there's no Jesus. No, I it's my opinion. I'm just Melrose. Right, but you're just saying they're, 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 but I'm they're, nobody. They're I'm like, nobody. Melrose, like, I'm, 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 yes. I want to ask you a couple questions. Anything at all. And then we're going to get to some real fun. Anything Sin is all. licking her chops. Sin, <laughs> yes. Sin just won a foot fetish competition. Yes. You're aware of this. I you Sin, tell, me, tell yeah. about he doesn't like feet. No, no, well, but not that I don't like them. I mean, it's just, Sin, tell, tell us about your I'm foot fetish competition. With him. I'm an ass man. There's no ass competitions. It's weird. Right, well, if there was, Sin Fist would win. That was last year when I won Miss Bootylicious. Oh, that's right. You did win Miss Bootylicious. And L.A. Speedweed Stunner Chick of the Year last yes. year. Yeah. Oh, yes, and, 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 and Josie won most ridges in her ass. So go ahead. You, uh... Fuck you. You fi finally got the first fuck you of the night. Are you happy? It's, all, it's only 25 oh, minutes yeah. in. Usually it's the first 10 it's, minutes. Uh, no, you're, you're you were Miss Dickly you're ass, not me. Come on. How, how do you even fucking know? I know you won Miss Dipley ass. So you won. What was the fit uh, thing that uh, you won? It was the most unique, fascinating, captivating foot model. Wow, I, I would go along with that. Yeah, it looks kind of a contortionist. My toes are double jointed. Her toes are double jointed. And um, for like the foot fetish community, I have stinky feet, and not a lot of girls have that. So it's kind of a rare commodity. Well, we were thing, talking so. about we were talking about pole dancing, and you don't uh, yeah. like when, when girls I hate are barefoot. It when girls pole dance barefoot. Drives me crazy. No one wants to see the fucking dirt on the bottom of your feet Ew. and your dirty hooker foot. Right. <laughs> and, and, and that leads me into Nick Sin because Nick Sin goes to strip clubs all the time. Actually, I was in Portland, hung out with Nick. Nick came in with Buggy Nova, the pro wrestler. I never met Nick. We hit it off. Cool yeah. guy. And we uh, we go to we go to Portland. He takes me to Dante's, and you're familiar with Dante's. So. Yeah, I used to headline Dante's back in the day when, when it first opened. When did you two opened. meet? Sin and Sin, when did you two meet? Uh, a couple years ago, I would say in the fall, when I went up to Seattle and Portland to work, and um, I was mistressing at Dante's, and that's when I met you, and you did the Marilyn Manson Act and the Straight Jacket Act. Yes, uh, I saw the yeah, Marilyn Manson. I, I did three performances that night at Dante's. I didn't see that that night, so <laughs> I'm glad you saw it. <laughs> you know, we, we, because he had... Two bottles. No, no, no he was night. buying me drinks. Well, actually, we, we, I need some of that. Hand that over here. <laughs> yeah, Melrose. He does. He does do mini, mini Marilyn Manson. Wow. He sings uh, to beautiful people like Marilyn Manson. It was a uh, Super Bowl Sunday, and you caught me right in the middle of the Super Bowl and my gig, which I'm surprised I remember seeing you that day. Yeah. I, I, <laughs> where, where are you originally from? I hear an accent. I'm from Massachusetts. And, he, you, you, like and, and you were in a mini kiss band too, right? I was. I was in the uh, original mini kiss. Oh, that's awesome. You were the, with the original mini kiss. Yeah, there's, there's like a ton there, of them. There's now. a couple of knockoffs. Were you Paul? Were you Gene? Who were you? I was you? Ace. You were Ace. Okay. So I, I was, see that. was allowed to not show up to the interviews because I was too fucked uh, up. You were allowed to be Blargan Flargan yeah. on, on camera. <laughs> <laughs> we're like, blah, blah, blah. Uh, well, yeah, that, that, that's the most accurate Ace Fraley you'll ever have is just be Blargan Flargan Flargan yeah. Flargan. And I was underage, so it was even better when I did it. Wow, baby-faced ace. Yeah. <laughs> Just fucked up, wasted, couldn't 
talk on the mic. So as you can see, this is the most unusual collection of people I could ever get in the studio. <laughs> Melrose Larry Green. Uh, uh, this, this is because Josie was calling you insane, and I, I take umbrage with that. But uh, uh, No, only... I don't think he's insane. I think what he de- did was insane by standing out there for but, hours. But, 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 but Josie, you know who else thinks he's insane? But you know what? It... I know who you are because of that. Right, right. So right. actually, it's a little bit of brilliant insanity. Well, I moved here, Josie, in 1980 to be a stand-up comic from Houston, Texas. Right. How's that uh, going? It's going great. I mean, I'm, that's what 34 years. Yeah, I've, I okay. mean, a lot of things are going on that are okay. good. Okay. I got. I'm on the road. I just came back from about seven or eight gigs in Florida. Oh, that's great. And I've got a band. I play rock and roll piano. I didn't know that. Yeah, there's a lot of things you don't know. Yeah. Well, that's why I, I, I found out yeah. a lot of things. But yeah. I, I was going to ask you when when you're yeah. on the Howard Stern show, and yeah. I, heard, I heard a couple clips. Yeah. Uh, online, and you're not on as much as you used to. I don't want to be on that much anymore. Okay. Yeah. Next. But, okay. <laughs> <laughs> they always call me. They want me to come on. I'm. I'm oh, not, okay. So, but uh, you, know, you can't live in the past. Well, I, was, I was listening to what? some. You're over it. No, no, I love it. I was listening to some, yeah. some vintage clips. Yeah. And you're talking. Right. And you could dominate a conversation and go on and on and on. Right. And they will start playing cuckoo noises. That's fine. I love that. You, 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 okay. So you don't take offense. No, Howard. When, Howard has told me more than once, Melrose, you're a fucking genius. Okay. Really? Yeah, he's right. I am. <laughs> and, and I laugh I like that no hesitation I laugh all the way throughout life the the key to happiness in this world is like Elaine Boozley used to say on TV never let them see you sweat I don't mean literally I mean figuratively if somebody fucks with you if somebody's an asshole let them hang themselves right let them go go with it people have called me the worst names them, oh fuck you, Melrose! You suck! You're well, a loser. The, the, some of the Stern fans I think are pretty we're vicious. All, gonna, uh, all share that. Yeah, 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 yeah. All yeah. I, don't, I don't give a fuck. But I, mean, but I will. I will say. I was I'm on... sitting next to Josie Katz and Fisted and Nick Sin, right? Right. Yep. Yeah, right. so, uh, and then Mark the Goth Comedian. You, you Get better. out the phone number so people can call well, in. If you want to talk to Melrose, Larry Green, Sin, Fisted, Nick, Josie, one 800 893 Six two, but I'm not going to take over this hour. I just want you to know I love you, man. I want you to take I over the hour. Take over the hour. Well, comedy. You half hour. I love you. Actually, we, I will. I will talk to you about a possible gig. You might. I might have you host, but I love you. And let me just say this: if anybody is out there that's listening, that might be gay, or that might be a cross dresser, or that might be into S and M. No, Rose, I'm not gay. No, I didn't say you. You've heard it like listening. three times already. I am not, just because I'm wearing makeup, I'm not gay. You need, you are, anybody in life, you are what you are. I am, I, is it just me or what? Yeah, you, 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 you are You've done you everything with called Nick and I fags. I mean, what are you doing, no, Melrose? Rose, Nick's not a fag. <laughs> Nick's not a fag, you just referred no, it again. You, no, I am not gay, Melrose. I didn't say you're gay. But you if, didn't say it, but you can't If anybody is it. gay out there, don't worry about it. Don't worry about it. And if you like to smell feet, don't worry about it. Thank you. Why do I have a thing for asses? That's I don't know. I have no <laughs> I idea. Of, I Why get a lot of ass guys, though. I'm an ass guy. Well, last time Sin was on smell. the show. Well, uh, no, Josie, I was going to say, last time Sin yeah. was on the show, our friend Joe Adams, the great comedian, yeah, I who has him. one yeah, arm, and arm, you saw yeah. it. Oh, yeah, and he I did the booty your, clap your, on his nub. He shoved yeah. his nub up your ass. I smelled the nub afterwards. <laughs> right. Sin Fistus has the best smelling ass I've ever smelled in my life. Stop. It was the, I'm serious. Tonight I'm gonna I didn't sleep. know what to expect. I was like, I didn't think I was going to smell anything. I was like, what is that, Chanel? It was weird. <laughs> <laughs> it was I, you know what's funny? I had asked, uh... Joe you had asked, with the nub. Asked. When he was on the show, have you done anything nasty? The first thing I thought when I saw it was I'll like, yeah, what nasty That's the first things thing have you I done thought. with that? That's the and first thing like, I thought. Oh, I've done all kinds of things. And then I found out that that was the first thing Oh, was with you. Yeah. So, right? He, he really needs to work that nub. He needs, yeah. So let, let's separate some fact and fiction for Melrose. Now, we got some fun stuff planned for you, Melrose. Yeah. So you're not Jackie Mason's accountant. No, and uh, before I was famous, I could do things I can't do now. Like? I used to go to a club in North Hollywood. Okay. A, a S&M kind of club, right? All right. And ah. it was great. I can't go anymore because people Everybody's know like, me. Everybody's like, Melrose, I agree, yeah. Yeah, yeah, but I love it. I love that what, scene. What, what Just do you wear like a BDSM mask. Uh, I went to a place that was called the yeah. Chateau. Yeah, put put like yeah. a mask on. I'm like but a dog thing. Gimp mask, yeah. Huh? No, and nothing. No gimp and, mask? And, and it, I don't even know what that is. I love the idea of 
of just let's let's go for it. Right. You know, let's go for it. And I'm a Jewish kid from Long Island, and I was always very repressed and mm -hmm. had to, you know, think a certain way. And one thing I love about Los Angeles, California, is you got everything out here. And I think you got everything in the studio, basically. You do, <laughs> you do. And the critical thing in life, most people are so full of it, it's not funny. Right. I never want to go to the Olive Garden on a date with a girl and find out what she majored in in college, but I'd love to spank her. Ladies, what that sounds like an invitation. 1-800-893-9562. You will not get linguine, but you'll get a nice spank on the ass. Harry, here's a gimp. I would take him to Hooters. Yeah. Oh, I Wear one of those. Oh, he doesn't want one of those. Right. I don't know. What if Newt Gingrich is watching Newt this? Gingrich. No, you know, I'm a, I am well, a Republican. Well, 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 what about this? You like this one? That one's hot. Oh I like that God. one. I don't know. Hold the dog mask, yes. Would you wear it for me? Well, can I breathe? Yeah. Yes, of course you can breathe. Uh, yes. if Josie's showing him a dog mask. If oh. Sin Fisted puts a dog mask on you, you will go. But I, 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 think, I, think, I think we got that. I have right? a mask fetish. I like wearing them, and I like seeing other people wear them. I've never worn a mask. Wear mask. <sighs> I, 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 I feel a Club it's Bizarre trip coming okay, on here. Maybe some people out there can answer this for me. I have a fetish for... Um, Josie, listen. Not being able to see any of the skin. So, like, motorcycle, like the crotch rocket oh. outfits, where it's the helmet, the jacket, the gloves... I have like Zentai suits. That's pretty hot. I don't know what the term for it is, though. So you like people that like uh, people that like, cover like, like, you like a man, completely, completely like, kind of like a man in a uniform. I'm thing. putting my, no, my no, hat really. on. I mean, mouth. like like from Hellboy, Car Robert Cronin. You can't see any of his skin at all. It's the complete mystery of not knowing who's under there. Uh, but I don't know what the fetish term for that is, but, but, and no one can tell me it. Hmm. But uh, yeah, uh, the, no, I don't know. Dementia. I don't know what it is. Uh, <laughs> But no, no, I, so, but that, that's but, why, like, see that this so is where I this is where I see. fail because if I cover myself from head to toe, you'd be like, "Oh, hi, Mark." <laughs> All right. I, I would just take it for you. They have the same, same, exact yeah. same problem. <laughs> Melrose can get away with it. Melrose, you are the most desirable man in this room, and you're in with Sid Nixon and myself. <laughs> and Nixon uh, and. Nixon is a, a you are yeah we, we we went through this last time. I said midget dwarf, you're a little person. That's fuck it. Yeah, but you're 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 a short guy. It's funny because I told Josie you were coming on. It's like I'm sick of dating short guys. And, <laughs> really? uh, oh, I'm that's sure you said a lot of girls. I'm sure this guy oh, no, gets tons of girlfriends. Yeah, but you said all guys yeah. I've dated have been over six. Because because I was like, yeah, oh, six six, six coming. He's like a, he's he's a little guy, and you're like. I hate short guys. I'm like, oh, okay. about to change. Oh. But Nick, Nick. <laughs> I don't say I hate oh, short Nick, guys. Oh, Nick, throw the moves. Because, Nick, I'll I bet you, like, you get, you get like, a lady like crazy, don't you, Nick? Oh, I, I don't. Yeah, I mean, I, I, I do have a race car bed, so, you know. you got A race car bed? <laughs> yeah. Oh, that's hilarious. He's <laughs> a good looking guy. Does it have an alarm? No. Do you have, like, Power Rangers seats on the bed? No, for that? I'm working on it. I'm working on it. I got LEDs and a fog machine. Hooked up to it. Right nice. Yeah, it's been Sid and I were talking. On the inside or the outside? The inside. So if a woman... Hey. If a, <laughs> <laughs> I, I was sober See, for... He's just covered I was all sober for 48 hours. Too. That's why. So wait, Sid, it's a, uh, Nick. <laughs> <laughs> Nick. I'll Nick. be Sin 1. He could be Sin 2. Uh, you, it's very simple. Here. Nick, so w w you, you got to have a lot of girls that come up to you that have... Like a fetish for this? I do. Um, mostly it's mostly it's girls in heels. They just like throw their leg over my face and like, oh yeah, the right height. And so uh, I don't, do you I don't, I don't your, complain. Is, do you, is do your you private you... parts equal to your size, <laughs> or is it? They're like normal are, people's parts. Or is it like a? Are you are you well hung size? like? I am well hung. Well hung like me and Larry, where we're normal guys that have short penises. I, I am like Howard Stern in that respect. I, I don't know what that means. Howard Stern brags about having yes, a very small if you, penis. If you, if you were Nick's size, that would look gigantic. Well, I, I can't even find it sometimes. <laughs> I was once on a gig with Stuttering John right. Right, and Artie Lang. And, we had and to you take lost a, your dick? Well, no, we had, we had it almost. We had to take a leak on the New Jersey Turnpike. So Stuttering John looked at me and says, where's your dick? <laughs> Why is Stuttering John <laughs> looking at your dick? That's what Artie said. Artie says, why are you looking at his dick? Where's your dick? Do you have a no, it's not that. Button small. penis. Oh. When it's what's button penis? Josie, what's button penis? <laughs> no, 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 no. <laughs> Sam, what is button penis? I don't know. I'm kind of confused. <laughs> Have you ever had a button penis? See, uh, <laughs> no, not a button. It's right. uh, yeah. We'll see with no, me. That's no, when the whole hands it's, come yeah, in. It's good right. when I get a hard on. They still have two hands. It's good when I'm hard. Right. You know, it's. Uh, well, I, I, I would hope so. You're yeah, a grower, not a shower. Yeah. What's that? You're a grower, grower not, not a shower. shower. Yeah, exactly. I would hope when you have an erection, that's when things are turning uh, upward for you. That's good. I am so 
into this hour. This is one of the greatest <laughs> hours. I was on the History Channel this morning no, doing please, my Larry, first. Let's talk interview. about your penis. And you're, you're missing the O'Reilly factor to talk about your penis, yeah, Larry. I am. I am, and and I want <laughs> I want you to understand that I am I am here because I want to be here. Right. And I believe the what Howard had picked up on me over the right. years is honesty. Well, I was and gonna I was gonna ask you. Yeah, I was gonna ask you. Anything I was at all. Asking Nick. Anything at all. Okay. Now, Nick gets girls because they're in. Now, Nick, when girls are into short guys and you know that they're, they're just trying to see what it's like and they're fetish, does it bother you? Do you want to be love for yourself or you don't give a shit? You're the I don't give a fuck. No. Okay. Larry. We were talking about this. Larry, Larry, Larry. We were talking about this on the ride over here. Larry, you must have women that want to have sex with you because you're part of the Howard Stern no, show. No, most girls. Especially back, back in the day when you were on a lot. Well, I'm still on a lot of programs. Most women are. I don't want to use a bad word, but most women are cunts. Yes. Sluts. Yes. Whores? Yes. Bitches. Yes. Swats. Yes. Bitches and yes. Yes. Nick, yes. Come, yes. come on in here. And, and, and skanks. You said them all. I've got a very good friend in my life who's not a girlfriend, a, a lady friend, who I really somebody care want to for. fuck that won't fuck you. Someone that used to. Th that, that's what we call Josie. Right. And and that's fuck okay with you. me. I want to fuck you. What's wrong but, with that? <laughs> there's nothing wrong with that. And 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 I think that life. If you have happiness in this world, let it be. Just like Paul McCartney would sing in that song, let it be. Uh, I, didn't, and, I, don't, I don't hate to interrupt you, Melissa. Yeah. Unless you do want to fuck me back. Maybe that's who you were so upset. I think I'm confused. Okay, Melrose, keep going. So Paul I, McCartney said... Hold on, uh, yeah, I want to help you out here, buddy. Okay. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> no, 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 she just had down for two years. I have to choke my what, car. What is that? Is that alcohol? Or what is it? Yeah, it's yeah, Fireball it's, Whiskey. It's, it's I've never had a drink in my life. You've never had a drink in your life. Now, Melrose, here, uh, I don't do drugs. Melrose, drink, we're going to talk to Sin because Sin's got a lot to talk yeah. about. Before you do, I okay. want to clear this up. Are you rich? Uh, I'm okay. Okay, so why do you? I have give a T-Bird. I haven't driven in years. Why do you give tours on Hollywood Boulevard? I hear I like, you're a millionaire. I like, I like the tour business because I know why you do comedy. You want to be a comedian. I get. I that. like the tour business. But you, if you didn't work again in your life, you're set. I don't. I don't want to say that. That'll. That'll. Cause a lot You're of people. You're buying us all a very expensive dinner after the show. Is that no, right? I'm, I'm oh, going. Oh, I gotta, okay. I gotta no, he's just buying me an expensive dinner. <laughs> I got to okay. go see <laughs> so Sean you, Hannity. So you, so Hannity. you always want to be a tour guide? No, I like the tour business. I like Because I was amazed when I saw you and, you, and I yeah. thought you were just piled inside. You're like, oh, yeah. no, I'm doing the tour thing. I'm like, aren't to you a millionaire? Yesterday, yesterday, and I don't want to I don't want to talk a lot, yes, but yesterday I made no sales at all. I made no money. I don't. I guarantee you none of you have ever worked an eight-hour gig I on have. your feet. I and have. You yes. really? I have. We all have. We all have. Okay. I have okay. where I ended up owing okay. money out of my pocket. Okay. That feeling is similar to the feeling of when you're getting, you're getting spanked like hundreds of times. After a while, it starts feeling good. And that's how I felt yesterday. I was so fucking mad at everybody that wouldn't buy my tours that after about three o'clock, I was I was okay with it. But that was like that's like the feeling of uh, calling it to the Howard Stern show, having them uh, put you on hold for the whole show. I don't mind. And not picking up. I don't mind. You never got pissed at that. You can't be. You know, I'm a Buddhist. I'm a, I'm a Jewish wow. Buddhist. Wow. Yeah. A I, Judist. I, I, exactly. <laughs> and I meditate a lot. And I I do my thing. I mean, yeah. yeah. I better, I better Howard's too, yeah. got a million people to talk to. Right. All right. But he doesn't have Sid Fista to talk to. No, he Sid would like Fista. to talk Not to yet. these two. No, 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 here's the thing. I'm going to talk to Sid Fista because we uh, we were talking about this last time you were after the show. Mm -hmm. I'll get back to you, Miles. Don't worry. I got a couple of other questions for you. No, I, I didn't still know you were going to play with. I didn't know. Yeah, we, oh, we got stuff to play with. You're going to get in the, yeah, oh, we got yeah. stuff. We got plans for you. Sid's going to play with you. <laughs> but let me ask you, because I want to get this out before we get to playing. You After the show last time, you shocked me. Because you said you want to get breast implants. Yes. And Josie, if you have any advice, please. <laughs> no, earlier like we were earlier we, earlier we were best talking invest, about best investment I've ever exactly. made. Exactly. <laughs> earlier we were talking about how people give like hate mail or negative things. I've never had that until I announced on my Facebook and Twitter that I am going to get breast enhancements. And I had people going, "Oh, you're so vain and blah 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 and all this stuff and like all this negative feedback and I try to explain to him like I'm a burlesque dancer right this is what I do for a living I'm not doing it for vanity reasons right. I am perfectly fine with my breasts how they are well, I, I hope you them. didn't think I was but, being negative I was just but, wondering why they're yeah, fantastic no, but for why me, do you but need for me, well this isn't me right now show, show, is, show, show them why you need you need breast implants this isn't me right now this is two big super padded bras um, but I'm doing it for work reasons. I'm a burlesque dancer, fetish performer, and it's an investment into my job. And I'll do anything for my work. And I've been avoiding it for 16 years. 
And right now I'm 34. If I'm going to do it, I need to do it now before it's too late. You don't look a day over 33. It's because I'm not married and I don't have kids and I do what I love for a living. That's right. That's right. <laughs> she smiles a lot, Melrose. That's the key to youth. <laughs> so if anybody wants to kind of, you're taking donations yes i'm taking donations implants. i'm taking donations for my breast Smart. implants if people want to help out you could go to my um website www.sinfisted.com and there'll be a donation button in the top right hand corner you just click on that and just put whatever in and i'm doing an offer right now if you donate a hundred dollars you get a free um signed double-sided poster free signed eight by ten and two free stickers so wow. I'm Whoa. trying to give back while people are. You see how to I me, juxtapose so. Melrose? Are you rich with you need money for breast implants? <laughs> that was a good I'm segue. Trying, I'm to <laughs> no, but I've only good had networking. the donation up for um, about a week, and I've already received some really good, like very generous donations. So right. I'm planning my surgery in December. I'm going to do it right mm -hmm. around my birthday. Right. So that'll give me enough time to save up, and you know, if people want to pitch in, I would love it. If not, no worries. But and, and, um, as, a, and as a birthday gift, I will be there to inspect them before and after. I will We'll need massaging for sure. Oh, you so, will get massages. The We're only all... downfall is I can't. Really? I can't is, is, pole is that true, dance. Josie? That you need massaging? Yeah, yes, yes. I can't. I can't pole dance for a year though. Mark, you take the top. I'll take yeah. the bottom. Yeah, I, I, because I'm yeah. going for a very natural look. That if I start pole dancing too soon, they'll come out of position and come straight up. And oh, look really fake. so really? that's what I've yeah, seen it. Yeah, yep, it's pretty yep. bad. You've yeah, seen it? So, oh yeah, I've seen it a lot with dancers too. Like as it's happening. You can see like the bag, like you see it like inflating, move, deflating yeah, as it's going. Yeah, so up and down. I'm gonna let it. I'm gonna give it a year off of pole right. dancing, but I'll still continue doing my grinder, my contortion, my burlesque, and everything well, else. Well, but I'll have to take a year off. Of well, pole a dancing. lot of people don't know what grinding is, and I'm glad that you brought the grinder today. Shall we show them? I think uh, well, I'm gonna turn the camera around because I want. Could you show Melrose? Have you seen her grind? I don't know what that is. Well, so explain, explain to Melrose what grind core is. I'm gonna turn this camera around. Oh, okay. Hold um. Well. It's uh, shooting sparks off my body with power tools. Oh my god! And, uh, <laughs> <laughs> I use I use a metal that doesn't ignite, and I also oh, use. Oh, I think a, I saw that at the uh, a, dragonfly that I night. Use a metal, or whatever it was called. I use yeah. a metal that doesn't have nickel in it because some people are allergic to nickel. So if someone if it has nickel and it touches their body, they can <sighs> go to the emergency room. So I did my research and all that before ahead of time and everything to make sure that it's, and, it's not only safe for me but it's safe. for And how did you start grinding? How did this start? Uh, I did it. Um, they had me do it on a. Uh, Black Label Society music video, Suicide Messiah, back right. in 2004. It was oh, their my idea? brother's a Black Label guy. Yeah, I was, in, was, in, a motor, I was in a motor, it was their idea, and I was in a motorcycle shop, and they just had this piece of steel in a vice, and they had me hold the grinder and do it then, right. and then I came up with the idea of making a bikini and shooting right. it off of my body. Well, could you demonstrate for Melrose? Yes. I think uh, we need to see Does this. Does someone want to come play Next. with my sparks, or am I just going to play Mel with Rose, myself? Melrose, do you want to play with her sparks? What does that involve? What is that? You can touch it. I think it, it sin needs you. to also. Nick? We could have uh, the two sins. Uh, uh, Nick, Nick can do it. Uh, uh, don't be scared. I think. No, I'll do it. If you guys don't do it, I'll, I'll do it. Do I'll do it. I'll do it. I'll do it. No, no, Melrose, you do it. I don't I know what this is going to hit me in the eye. Hit you in the eye? Open your mouth. Because you're not tall enough? No. Go ahead, Melrose. Go ahead. Go over there. She's got something for you. He's crotch size. Oh, my God. I am crotch size. That's uh, what I'm afraid of, what she's wearing. It's going to poke me in the eye. No, you see away, and it shoots down. I'm shooting it down. Hold on. Wait, I I'll show you. I, uh, oh, I got it. I got it. I don't know what to do anymore. Okay, hold on. I'm a, I don't know what to do anymore. Yeah. Check, check, one, two, check. Hello? Okay. Sin? Yes. Hi. Yes, I, I can't hold at the same time. Right. So I'm here. Okay. Melrose, you want to hold? Uh, uh, Sinfist is going to be grinding right now. All right, it's going to get loud. Okay. Well. <laughs> hold on, hold on, hold on. Oh. 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 Josie, are you taking pictures of this? Melrose, she knows what she's one doing. More, one more. That gets hot. It smells like the photo. dentist. It does. Oh, that was Josie. Don't but... remind me. That's me. Oh, Hold on. Wow. Wow. This did never disappoint. Hold on, then. I got to... Oh, I can do this all day. It's so good. Oh, my God. Oh, wow. Have you ever had an orgasm from vibrating? It does vibrate. Uh -huh. That's a good question. Now, is, is this? Is, I'm gonna, I'm gonna come over and go ahead. Spark a little bit more here. 
She has a heart-shaped metal thing on her vagina. She has a heart on on her vagina. And she's shooting sparks. Now, I'm going to... The studio's flipping out like a little bit. No, no, no. Uh, uh, no, you can sit down if, you, if you're not comfortable. So, 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 yeah, is there uh, smoke alarms in No, here? no, she's, uh, so, the Sin, uh, so, Sin, uh, what, how does that feel? It feels amazing. Whoa. Really? Especially when I start doing this to it's it. It's warm and it, really it vibrates. vibrates. Yeah. Oh, what a, I love this. <laughs> no, thing. Great. Welcome Why to the Dark Mark Show. Thank you, Sin. Thank you for grinding. Now, did you bring your straight jacket, Sin? Yeah, it's like cute. Okay. I gotta watch, I got hot. Mark, this is the reason why. We're in Afghanistan and for Korea the freedom. and Japan. No, we're, 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 I don't, don't get me started. No, no, no. Uh, it, this it, is the reason. Melrose Larry Green's a, a big conservative now. We're, we're in but there because the uh, I understand. Melrose? This is unbelievable. You couldn't do this in you North Korea. No, no. Take your jacket off, Let's please, Melrose. Off. Melrose, we're going to have some fun with you. Oh, Sin, right. no uh, more Sin sparks. No more sparks. Jacket. No uh, more sparks. Only for you, Mark. Well, no, only for Sin Fistic. Hold on. Sin, do you need help putting it on her? Both jackets off or one? Oh, I Sin, just had Sin, one on the other night. Sin is going to tell you what to do. All right. Okay. It's not going to hurt, will it? No. It's going <laughs> to tie you up and maybe poke you with a stick or something. Actually, well, brought, I brought well, mine, and then spanky. I saw you post it, Mark, yeah. and I, I didn't you. want to. We had a whole, when Melrose Larry Green called in last time, Sin Fisted was in town. Sin Fisted. He said, I, I said, saw Sin you. Sin like, I want to put you in a straight jacket. Like, is this okay? Yes. And he said, no. And she said, if I do it, he said, yes. Go ahead, Melrose. <laughs> what do I do? Just come over here. Well, well, come over here and stick your arms out. Put one out, foot like in front of the other. Walk over there, uh, Melrose. You're going to be okay. <laughs> Only for no you. sparks. Only for you. Just stick your arms I out. I want like, to apologize to the Republicans. We're going to trust you. Re Republicans, Republicans can be in straight jackets, too. What's Apologize. wrong with that? Rush Limbaugh, Sean Hannity. <laughs> Don't apologize Hello, to Rush Riley. Limbaugh. He's, he's a drug addict. Come on. What's the matter with you, Melrose? Rush Limbaugh imitated Howard Stern. You know that. Well, uh, Doesn't he say that? Yes. yes. Is there a radio show that Howard Stern says he does not yeah. imitate, that There's doesn't imitate him? What? Every show he says he, they imitate him. Rush Limbaugh. Cross my arms. Do the arms after. Wait. Oh, okay. Now. First. Put your arms down. Oh, sorry. This, I've never done this before. You've never been in a straight jacket, Melrose, Larry Green? I highly doubt that. This is actually an official war. Uh, this is from a psychiatric institute. Yeah, I think yeah. he's the Josie, do you have the mic? Uh, who has the mic? Look, I work on Hollywood Boulevard. Can I you, have the mic. Please, uh, please do some audience. running commentary because we have people that can't see this on okay. iTunes. Okay. Let's dig in. Um, right now, we are tying, we are buckling up. <laughs> And tying up Melrose, Larry Green, <laughs> in Mel a Mel official uh, uh, Melrose, uh, Melrose straight has something to say. It's comfortable, right, Melrose? Yeah, it's like I did a bungee jump in Dallas. Yeah, you might want to put the microphone in his face. It's not bad. I mean, the fact that Sin Fisted is putting this on me is great. How much do you yeah, like Sin Fisted? I would. Like this. I think Sin Fisted is about the hottest chick out there, along with Josie Cat. Josie Cat's oh, well, hot, but yeah. Yeah. Thank you. Sin Fisted has the Betty Page look. Yes, I'm he does. A, I'm in love with the. Betty By the Page. way, uh, Melrose, would you would it would it uh, honor you to know that yes. she did her hair especially like that for you? Uh, it does honor me. Yes. Yes. I think this is a great girl, and I saw her that night with my friend Julian oh, Douglas, so and I was so amazed by Sin Fisted <laughs> that. I went on the. Um... He's got broad shoulders. Melrose, you're a, you're a pretty buff guy. Um, uh, yeah, underneath. It's, it's under, a, it's under, a, yeah, I'm sixty. I go underneath. Melrose is in good shape for sixty. Well, sixty-three. I've heard I've heard all sorts of interesting things on your age. Last time you said you were fifty-four. I'm born in nineteen fifty. So that yeah, that's what it says. Yeah. That's what it says on your Wikipedia Lawrence page. Lawrence Greenblatt, my real name. Yeah, Larry Green, and I can't get the. Uh, Melrose the Larry word. Green is a nom de plume. Mel right. Which uh, means pen uh, name. How, does, no, no, how no, does it feel? Is it tight? It's great. No, I mean, Larry, I think that uh, we're you, just. You know, we're gonna leave you here for, for about an hour and go have dinner. <laughs> Melrose Larry Green ran for mayor twice. Twice. Yes. I don't think you'll be running for mayor. Again. You know, <laughs> not Eric after this. Eric Garcetti is a great mayor. He's a friend of mine. So is Mayor Villaraigosa. Okay, so we we can all sit back not, down. Not on the, the not on the grinder though. No, no, oh, we're gonna go back. Okay. We're gonna go back. So so. Melrose is in a straight, straight like jacket. No okay. Now, Nick, you you do straight jacket work yourself. I am. I am actually. How does that feel being in a straight jacket? Do you mind moving my stuff? I will. It's not so bad. Um, I'm actually. The world's, uh, uh, world's oh, yeah, just smallest. Just, just put on here. <laughs> you have a custom made small straight jacket. Yeah, it's, uh, it's, it's custom made. It's the world's smallest straight jacket. You shape it upside down. Upside down. You know what? Yeah, kind of comfortable. That. That was this, I, I kind of like it. It's like, yeah? I do like look, it. I run every like morning. I work out. I've done marathons. 
This is great. Oh, you can do it. Oh, oh yeah. Oh, here oh, we go. Now, now we're here. Oh, this is great. Yeah, you can't do shit about that, can you? <laughs> the girls are okay. Okay. Yes. Yes. So Now the rest are of the show, are the are you girls tiglish? are going to have their way with Melrose, Larry, <laughs> Grace. Are you Oh, Josie Cat is tickling her. Yeah, Sid Vincent is slapping his face. This is great. Melrose, Larry, Grace. Howard Stern doesn't treat you this good, does he? Newt Gingrich is not watching this. Newt Gingrich. Stand up. New Gingers would do this. You know New Gingers. He's a horny guy. I don't know if I can stand up. Stand up. Stand up. Oh, he's going to put you up. Okay, so now he stood up. Lean towards me. <laughs> Josie Cat is oh, turning him around, oh, and Sid Fiston is going to be spanking oh. him. Oh. oh, wow. Wait, wait. You want, you want to torture Mellor's Larry Green? Sid Fiston, wow. Sin. I'm going to give you a challenge. Oh. Wait, wait, hold on. You, know, oh, you got to oh, lean forward. Oh, Sin Wait, I, I'm going to give you a challenge. Go this way. Oh. Who's your daddy? Hold uh, Sin Fiston. <laughs> oh, anybody, oh. anybody drive to Hollywood after this? <laughs> hold on, hold on. Are you butthurt? No, no, it's not bad. It's wait, not wait, bad. you're going to have to do that all again because <laughs> I didn't get it on camera. Okay, lean forward. Lean forward. Come, come to me. Come, come to come, here. Come, come get oh. over here. Oh. Come forward, oh. more, more. Lean more. Just got to get in there. Oh, yeah, that's right. Okay. That's wow. Rosie. Tickle, 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 tickle. Melrose, I agree. Will you do anything for Sid Feston? Yes. I've got a challenge. I have a challenge. Yes. Sin, I won't pay for the breast implants. Sin, no, no. Oh, let's do you it. don't need them. I you don't you, need I them. You, Sin, you do not this isn't Sin. Me. You don't need them. Sin, if you can get Melrose, if you can get Melrose, take, take, take the bras off. Take the bras off. Go ahead. Oh, wait, 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 wait. No, your tits are great. Okay. All right. So you see Wait, wait, watch. Watch what Sin fest See how voluptuous she is. See the smoke and mirrors. Okay. She's I'm going to be very bra. honest with you. Sin Fist is taking off her bra. I hope we get this on camera. Oh, plural, so more than three one. Wait, How many bras do you have on Sin? Two. Two bras. I'm going to be honest with you. If, if How about that? I like it. So far, no, you have great tits. Look at that. I've got it on camera. Tits. You have Those great are, tits. Uh, I see the nipples. They're great. I'm getting hard. Trust me, I like them too, but for hard. work reasons, I, I need them. <laughs> but yeah, I mean, look at what I'm working with here. I mean, these you know, are not... Mark you know, Jews always hand. talk with their hands. These are like boobs So over this my is boobs. really hard for a Jew to... It's such torture <laughs> because you can't talk with his hand. If you really want Wait to torture... Wait till you get the gag ball. Oh, he's amazing. If you want to torture <laughs> Melrose Larry Green, I'm going to give you a challenge, Sin. All right. Yeah. Get him to say Barack Obama is the greatest president of all time. <laughs> oh, I'll say, say it. it. He's not that bad. <laughs> That's not the same. No. You know what? Barack Obama is the president of the United States, right. okay? So you're not going to talk disrespect to him no, now? No, no, no. Like you're out of the office, you're going to call him but he's, I he's okay. I would love to have a cup of coffee with him and, and yeah, ask yeah. him a lot of questions. He's a smart Hopefully guy. not in a straight jacket. But, with uh, a bra on your head. A bra on my head is okay. two bras on your head. That's fine, that's fine. And a straight jacket. <laughs> it's like the Jews wear a little talus around their uh, shoulders. <laughs> yeah, it's kind of, it's kind of, it's kind of like a yarmulke. No, I, yeah. I'm, I'm actually not Jewish, it's, it's funny. It's a bromica. It's a brother. It's a brother. <laughs> <laughs> it's funny you should mention that, Melrose, because I did a comedy show. Yes. And, and you're a great comedian, by yeah, the way. Yeah, well, jeez, please, please, please say, really keep are. saying that. But I had a guy tell me I, had, I am yes. the most Jewish looking non Jew he's ever seen in Who his said, life. That's a good line. Who said and that? I think Stephen Glickman said that. That's actually pretty funny. And, uh, I thought you were Jewish. Yeah. yeah, a lot of people do. We're all like sweating. All the sparks I'm all are sweaty. <laughs> That's all you got to do is just spank him a little bit? That's oh, it? That was a good spanking, let me oh, tell you. Oh, there'll be more. Wait, no, was, well, I want to talk hard. about this. And Nick, I'm sorry that we didn't talk that much to you. I think you're enjoying things. I'm, I'm just <laughs> sitting back. I have no problem with this. Josie, you, you, know, you know that's interesting. Oh, my bra. Well, you got to put that bra back on. Put the bra back on. Put the bra back on. I don't mind this. This is not bad. gag him with the bra. Gag him with the bra. Yes, gag him with Sin Fist's bra. Oh, Open your mouth. <laughs> Open your mouth. Okay, they are gagging Melrose Larry Green. Oh, <laughs> Sin Fist oh, is rough. Man. Well, we were talking in the car, Josie. Josie kind of gagged. Sorry, it's a little salty. I'm a little sweaty. I did what Howard Stern could not do. I shut Melrose Larry Green up. I gagged <laughs> him with a bra. In a straight Sin jacket. Sin Fist uh, teaches a lot of classes. And uh, one of the uh, classes you teach is lap dance? I, I, yeah, I do like pole dance, lap dance, and floor work classes. What is there to learn about lap dance? You just grind on the guy's dick? No, that's just no, grinding no, on a guy's no, dick. No, no, no. There's a whole Nick, etiquette you know on doing it. Yes, yeah, you gotta, yes. gotta get a good lap dance. And there's yeah, nothing, there's nothing Wait, more sexy yeah. than a girl trying to give a lap dance and then falling right off the lap. You know, Wait, it's you like know, you, know, gotta, you, know what? you gotta uh, you shift know what? your weight and balance. We've tortured Mallory's leg. You wanna give him a little lap dance? <laughs> Can we do the do we worst some... lap dance story? Oh, no, let's oh. hear Nick's, Nick's lap yeah. dance story. I want to hear this. Okay. I got puked on during the lap oh. dance. What? Yes. Oh. What? Yeah. I had a girl oh. puke on my stage once. She oh. took too much ecstasy. Oh. And just, I had to run off stage and I was like, but no. Well, I got puked on. Wait, wait, wait. Oh. That's a bad lap. Did you tip her? Did you Did punch her in the cunt? Um, no, I didn't tip her. It was kind of like an after hours thing. And um, she just, it's like, oh, just come in the back room with me. And I thought we were kind of like, 
you know. Vibing and things. Yeah, and then um, as soon as I, she kind of did this, like, dry heave thing, and as soon as I left the room, I was like, oh, I think it's over because she's kind of drunk, and I'm drunk, and it's like 4 o'clock in the morning, like two hours after the bar closed. And uh, somebody <laughs> tapped my shoulder and goes, oh, you got a lot of lives just in time. And as she's puking behind it, she has a chair out of the chair. Uh, and I got to tell you, Mel is going to back me up on this. I know from firsthand experience, when a girl vomits, it's not a good sign. No, not at all. Not a good sign. I I thought it was Mark, fun. I got, I got to tell you something. This Unless you're into that. is so... I'm having... <laughs> Josie, you seem to know something here. about that. Have you dated men that are in their puking? No. I dated no, men who wanted me to. But there's, but there's a too. huge fetish Wait, 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 wait. This is the last story of the day. Tell us about this. There is a guy that wanted to. I dated a guy who wanted me to. Of all he the things to... you can do, uh, contortioning. Uh, I, I crossed the line. I'm fine with pee, whatever. Pee on me, I'll could, pee on you. I'm fine with fluids. Could you lift your legs so people fine. know what you can do? And I'm fine... I'm fine with blood and whatever right. and spit and all that. Right. But I cross the line when it comes to vomit oh and shit. Right. And I yes. dated this guy. Yes, <laughs> as I'm I... folding myself in half. I dated this guy who would, whenever I was on top of him, he would want me to stick my fingers down my throat and puke on his chest. Wow. And I was like, I can't, I can't do that. Let I, me tell you I, something. I, my uh, mind no way, and no Meryl's Larry Green and Nixon's mind, they're all wandering of things we really want you to do. There's a lot of positions and a lot of things oh, that are crossing yeah. my mind. Oh, yeah, no, it comes in handy. Vomiting is not one of them. No, no. I, well, no. Just, there was a guy on the Stern Show that called the Vomit King, Jeff Levy, oh. and he was really disgusting. Did he do porn? Did he do the vomitorium? Yeah, 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 yeah. I think I saw yeah. a couple of those. Yeah. Well, I, know. I saw a couple of them. <laughs> I had a you, you, you no. couldn't just see one. You had to see a couple. Yeah, I, I was trying to say, right? I had a roommate that lived more. Yeah. He was like, you got to see this. Howard Stern, like, let me tell you something. <laughs> Melrose Larry Green, even though he came on the show, he's loyal because he wouldn't let me... Wrap up the show without a Howard Stern reference. So there you go. Baba Booey to everybody. You, the Jeff, the, he had a guy that vomited, but we put you in a straight jacket, and she she grinded and lifted her leg. Can I, can I, I just want to say one quick thing. Go, go, I want to thank you for this opportunity. I want to I thank... I this camera right... At least the camera's right on you at your bar. Uh, three bar. important friends, Howard okay. Stern, Jimmy Kimmel, and Jimmy Fallon. They're all friends of mine. Right. And this is all in fun, and to be with this infisted... And Josie Cat and Nick Sin, but especially Sin Fisted. This is one of the <laughs> greatest thrills of my life. Melrose, you were great. When people, if people got to get, want to get a hold of you, I told you, you I was going to be here. I, yeah. Melrose, I'm glad you were a guest. You're, you're a cool guy. I've met you a few times. I remember when I was sitting with a girl in yeah. a restaurant. You circled the block about five times because you were so stoked that I recognized you, yeah, asking me yeah, if I like Jack. Yeah. You're already better. Yeah, all yeah. that stuff. I'm glad you came on the show. Get a hold of me. I'm on, you know, Facebook. That's Melrose Larry is on Facebook uh, at Melrose Larry on Twitter. Yeah, I'm, and, I'm uh, just a regular guy. And I'm on Hollywood Boulevard every day selling Hollywood tours. Boulevard. Yeah, and uh, and uh, uh, Nixon. Yes, you, you're in Portland. I'm in Portland. And, uh, and, I'm and actually, hey, how'd you get down here? <laughs> uh, I, I flew. This uh, is the show. No, no. And he said I'm, two words. I'm, I'm actually working on a movie right now. Uh, the director of the movie is in the uh, other room. Well, what's, what's the movie? Tell us about the it's movie. It's called Daniel. It's supposed to be like an uh, an R-rated version of Elf. And uh, we did have a... <laughs> yeah, we, we, we did have... porn? That's what we've been waiting for, we, is we, an R-rated version of Elf. We did have a uh, Hellboy reference earlier, and I'm actually working with the special effects artists of Hellboy oh, awesome. right now. That's great. And that's why I'm in L.A. And, uh, what part of Boston are you from? Um, I'm from... Uh, Western Mass. So. Springfield, Pittsfield. Pittsfield. Oh, yeah, yes. that's where the Red Sox played. I went to camp in Great Barrington. Ah, look how happy he there is. There you go. I, went to, I, love, yeah. I love Massachusetts. Is Pittsfield. it okay if I plug a few things? Oh, no, no, yeah, yeah, yeah. Nick, I want uh, people get a hold of you. How do they get a hold of you? Um, there's nicksin.com. I don't know how to run it yet, but there is nicksin.com, N I K S I N.com. And I can't believe Josie Cat's sweating more than me. So I find her on <laughs> Facebook, Josie Cat. It's K A T. And the floor is yours, Nick. Uh, I almost called you Nick. <laughs> I have a couple upcoming shows. Um, March 1st, uh, Devil's Playground will be premiering Gods of Rock. It's all female burlesque dancers imitating male iconic rock gods. And I will be, be doing... performing as Marilyn Manson doing my four-legged stilts. Ooh. And um, Star Girls, which is our Star Wars burlesque, is March 28th at the Dragonfly. And then we'll be doing again March, uh, sorry, May 4th for May the 4th Be With You at the Conga Room. <laughs> and then we're bringing back Video Game Girls in June while we will be performing as some Zero from Mortal Kombat. Oh, that's great. And right. if people want to contribute to give you new tips. Yes, please. Yes. Uh, Sinfisted.com. Click the donation button. Please and thank you. Any little bit helps. Thank you, guys. All right. This has been a great show. It's time for the spank train, everybody. Everybody's going to spank each other. Yes. Everybody have a wonderful week. <laughs>